Hearing instruction and being wise, two key elements needed in each of our lives. Southern gospel singer Ernie Haas has spent more than half of his life trying to do just that, as he brings the message of Christ to thousands via microphone and stage. Ernie Haas and Signature Sound is a longtime favorite in the region, and recently Van Wert was the place to be, part of something brand new for Ernie Haas and his band, Inspirations of Broadway, a three-city tour that highlighted Broadway over the years, plus a few well-known song and dances. Jennifer was at the event and had a chance to talk with Ernie before the show. What a joy it is to have Ernie Haas and Signature Sound, a part of the incredible Inspirations of Broadway event happening at the Nicewanger Performing Arts Center. Ernie, we always love to have you come to this area. I have to be honest with you, you, I think you'll forever have a following right here from Northwest Ohio. I hope so. I hope so. And they've been very supportive through the years and, you know, with all of our ideas and things that we do. And, but then this one, this is a new idea. This is a new endeavor. And so I was kind of skirmish. I was like... Uh, will they come? Will they be a part of it? And so we got a great crowd tonight, and we're excited, and we're very thankful. What do you think makes this special? Because this is different than what we might expect from a Signature Sound concert. That's true, but the, the reason it's, it's working, I believe, is because it's authentic to who I am inside. I think the older you get, uh, in just a few weeks I'll be 50, and I, so I think you start the second half of your life, you start going back to what you really know and what you were brought up, and, and the, the music keeps coming back to you. So. Um, I mean, it's no secret I was raised in church, singing gospel music, so thus signature sound. Uh, but I was also just as equally involved in my local. Um, I was blessed to have a, a community that had a great performing arts center, and, uh, and it was adjacent to our school. So all through junior high, high school, and even into college, I was always in the, the musical theaters, uh, portrayals of all the different things that they had out. And um, I was the only guy on the football and baseball team that was also in the in the thespian club and in the show choir. So, <laughs> so these these songs, um, I've been singing them my whole life, and uh, and a lot of these songs they have been sung in uh, the gospel music world, like Climb Every Mountain, or Never Walk Alone. So a lot of these inspirational songs from Broadway have been sung already by gospel quartets like Signature Sound. Speaking of gospel music, southern gospel music, all of those things that of course you're also very well known for, not too long ago the Dove Awards. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, tell us about your award or awards. I think there were a couple of them. Uh, there was a few that we were up for. We won. Uh, our latest endeavor was uh, a recording called Oh What a Savior. And that was up for Record of the Year, Southern Gospel Album of the Year. And we won. That We won that, that night. So that was great. And we were still riding high on that. And, uh, and then we were up for some more awards. Doug Anderson, our baritone singer, who's been with me since day one, uh, his solo record called Drive was up for Country Album of the Year and Country Song of the Year. He won two Dove Awards that night. And then I was a part of, and where a lot of people will remember how they first heard even my name Ernie was with the cathedrals and so back in the fall we did our family reunion with all the the surviving members of the cathedrals and uh, we just said we owe it to ourselves to do a special event we get together and let's sing and whoever wants to come can come and that night in Fort Worth over 3,000 people showed up and and we sang we did three concerts in two days mm -hmm. and we were able to capture it um, and so we put that out that video and that CD and it won a Dove Award for special event of the year so that was that was that was not planned. It just happened. So, so with the Cathedral Family Reunion, with Signature Sound, uh, with all the guys solo at the career, with our record company we started a couple years ago called Stowtown Records, and now with Inspiration of Broadway, um, it's keeping me young. It's keeping me vibrant. It's keeping me, you know, I need challenges in my life and. Uh, with music, you know, life gives you challenges as it is that you don't want, but uh, musically, um, I love the challenge, I love the diversity, and I love that we're singing to a lot of new people.